Rock and roll. So here's a great joke for Christmas. Nice, clean joke. Two blondes are sitting at lunch, and the first blonde says, you got something on your cheek. And the other blonde goes like this. She says, nah, the other side. She goes, <laughs> Merry Christmas. Jokeland.com. I got to go. I got to play Santa Claus. <laughs> It's the Jim Kerr Rock and Roll Morning Show on Q1043. One of my favorite Christmas songs of all time. That's Christmas rapping. The Who with the Cope and Long Live Rock. I'm in for Jim Kerr on the Jim Kerr Rock and Roll Morning Show this morning. It's 641 in the studio with us. Longtime friend, Jackie the Joke Man, Martin Link. Guy's girlfriend has a very small apartment. And she has a small couch because it's a small apartment. And she has a cat. Right. And whenever the guy comes to the apartment, if he wants to sit down, the cat is always sitting in the middle of the couch because it's so small. So to sit down, he's got to move the cat. And every time, he's got to move the cat, and it makes him nuts. And one time, he shows up, and she's not there. So he takes the cat, uh-huh. drives 10 miles away, and lets it out, and goes back to the apartment. Uh-huh. And when he gets there, the cat's on a couch. Whoa. <laughs> wow. So a couple of weeks later, she's not there again. So he takes the cat, drives it 20 miles, lets it out, comes back. He gets back to her apartment. The cat is on the couch. How about that? He gets, next time he gets in, she's not there. Takes the cat, drives 100 miles, he goes over the state line, he goes over the river, he goes down the subdivision, goes 10 blocks, turns right, goes another 10 blocks, throws the cat out the window, turns around, zooms home. Hour and a half later, he calls the apartment, his girlfriend answers, is, is the cat there? She says, yeah, he's on the couch. She says, put him on the phone, I'm lost. <laughs> K1043, New York's classic rock station, 710 on the Jim Kerr Rock and Roll Morning Show with Cope Phil and end today. We got Jackie and Shelly. One radio station was off the air for a couple of minutes because Cope was asleep. No, that didn't happen. That the happened. Stairway to Heaven was playing and started to skip, and it skipped for a half an hour because Cope was out. No, no, no. Oh, come on, let's pretend. And then the he woke up and he knocked, <laughs> knocked the needle, and people are listening to drive along. And like, <laughs> no, the way Howard would have to- told that was that I was with my feet up on the on the mixer, <laughs> leaning back, talking to a chick, he said. Ah. And then I fell out of the chair. And when I got up, I scrambled, and then I knocked the needle off it. That's great. And he gave me an FME award for that. Now, you got to come to Ferraris. I got all new jokes. I got a new CD coming out Saturday night at 10 o'clock. I'm at Ferraris. And then the following week, I'm at the record collector store in Bordentown, New Jersey. I'm going to be in aisle three. <laughs> you know, it's the smallest place in the world, but one of the guys... Yeah. was saying he was there. It's a tiny little place, and they have all kinds of people performing there. It's, a, it's an actual record store, but it's a, there's a little a performing real space. record store. But but not a big one. <laughs> it's like a, like a record store. But, but it exists is what I'm amazed at. Yeah, most are out of business, Jackie. You know? They're well, gone. Well, you know, it's antique records and, and collectors only. Oh, it's real high-end place. Oh, nice. And the people are right at your feet, and it's so intimate, right? I remember kissing you. Yeah. No, kissing no, Chris? No. <laughs> really? So, okay. It's the Jim Kerr Rock and Roll Morning Show on Q1043.